There is a competition between the North Queensland towns of Innisfail, Babinda and Tully for which one is the wettest town in the country and it's known as the Golden Gumboot. And more often than not, the winner of this prestigious award goes to with an average annual rainfall of 4.25 metres to the little town of Babinda. Babinda is typical of the towns you encounter on a trip to the tropical north. Its lush, beautiful rainforest is shadowed by two of the state's highest peaks. You'd think all that rain would dampen the spirits of the good people of Babinda, when in fact, it's quite the opposite. We look at places up in the tablelands, as far north as Cooktown and, and, uh, and down to Innisfail, and just fell in love with this place. It's the wettest town in Australia, and uh, when you have a look at the greenery around the place, and it's just absolutely beautiful. And that is how Babinda Kayak Hire was born. If you want a bona fide North Queensland experience, head just out of town, look for the kayak in the tree, and Gary will set you up for a self-guided tour down beautiful Babinda Creek. You, you can be out on a kayak on Babinda Creek and think that you're the only person on the planet. Yeah. The creek winds around in a number of different areas yeah. and uh, one of the spots that we'll go to today that we'll see Chris, uh, we can actually look back up at Mount Bartle Freya and you just have a look at that and you think that you could be in the middle of anywhere. You could be in the Amazon mate, yeah. you could be in the Amazon. Babinda Creek is a permanently flowing mountain stream nine kilometres in length but don't let the distance put you off as this is what Gary likes to call couch potato paddling. All you need to do is sit back and let the creek do all the work. Um, you can imagine you're the only people on the planet in the, in the most beautiful waterway in the world. Uh, and then you go around another bend and, and there's cane fields. Yeah. Um, at certain times of the year when the harvest is on, people actually get to see how cane is harvested. While you may encounter the odd small rapid, Gary says kids as young as five can kayak on the Babinda as long as they can swim. There are also double kayaks for hire so kids can share with mum or dad. At the moment the water level is up a little bit, mm. but even still it's only, in some spots, it's only two and three foot deep. Mm. Families could just pull up whenever they want, have a, you know, have a bit of a picnic or you know, have some lunch. Yeah, they do all the time. Mm. There's, there's quite a lot of sandy beaches and that's one of the benefits of it. 